Hey everybody, I'm back after an unexpected hiatus, whatever the proper pronunciation is in English. Um, long story short, I went through a tough time recently and I, I suppose I still kind of am. Um, I haven't really played war game or anything over the past one and a half months or so, which you didn't fully get to notice, I suppose, since I had like three weeks or so worth of videos ready, which you saw up until like mid December or something, then there was nothing else to upload. Um anyways. That's that's about that. So we're playing in Sardo. We're playing Dutch German Coalition. As you can as you can see. Nothing really out of the ordinary gonna happen, I think, when it comes to the opener. Oh yeah, I should mention this is a deck. It's like a kind of special deck I built. Well, not special, but a deck with stingers, because usually you can't really fit in man pets, at least not in Dutch German Coalition. Um, at least as long as you also want to put in ATGM squads. So this is a deck where I kind of have a compromise. Um, no elite infantry because they're card inefficient and instead relying solely on line and shock squads, which isn't too bad. And considering that we have good fire support, it's not really a big issue. He's playing Yoruko Armored, by the way. Not really sure if we need a Gavard. His helicopters are weak. I can probably expect a Leclerc and I don't know which tanks he decides to spam, whether it be medium or light tanks. I think going for a 2A4 and else or a Leopard 2 spam would be a mistake, so let's go with 2A5. As long as we stay out of close quarter combat, we should be fine against a Leclerc. Right, let's go. I don't think he gets anything wheeled or anything with an autocannon that he can properly sneak around. I don't think the Lux is an armored. Best recon vehicle is probably gonna be the AMX 13. Oh, 
Right, I forgot he gets the tank. That MX10. That's interesting. to it for that. I needed smoke to close the bridge at uh, the gap. And he didn't have it. No, it's not landed. That's why Milan can't shoot at it. I thought it might be landed, but actually just flying very low. I have to watch out. There's an MX-10 in there. 16 AP side shot is gonna do a lot of damage. Let's also try to deal with those commanders powder using our escort. Oh, a bit too many flinger fast.
Yeah, maybe there wasn't even anything in there. Is this his own? Is this on 2FF? Interesting. Get a CV. Let's get a tiger on the left. I wouldn't be surprised if he has trouble dealing with that on the flank. It with both up front. Obviously, didn't kill it, but that's basically as expected. Got our own leopard two on the left. to keep vision there, otherwise we might just be able to drive in with the tank and I won't even notice. Oh, that's not good. I lost one full squad there. Does have line of sight on this? I'm not sure if it just shot. No, it didn't. He did kill my scout there on the right, that's annoying. Really 
using the Lars on. Let's refill that, that's definitely worth a very point investment. The harpoon is not 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 even close on the level of this MX-13, by the way. In case you were wondering. Nice, we got a free head on it. We turn off, turn on ammo. Definitely need reinforcements, though. Are we gonna try to go for the MX-40 instead of the 205? Not gonna be able to kill the 205. I would if it was 5 HP. Actually, no. Um, I think 6 HP would actually be enough for 200, but I think it was at 8. Like it matters. This up to the front line. That's my supply truck dead. It's unfortunate. Unfortunate. Leopard 2 apparently had line of sight on my Rick and Leopard. Is the second 2 of 5? Shouldn't be in the open. At least I killed the Rican. That's good. You're gonna refill the Lars. No need to use the stinger on the tiger. Oh. Nice. Well then. 
Right, second to five. Forget about that. Well, that was a perfect side shot. Water has no ammo anymore. Kill this again. Left his escort. I think are not the most useful against the stack, but I think against all these pirates, at least they aren't really useless. I think usually against armored decks, you don't have access to Heinz, you don't see a lot of helicopters, if any. So I think playing against Sarato, who really likes the pirates. I got, I, in a way, I got lucky with them again. He is playing armored, which is, again, a deck that generally doesn't really benefit too much from. Where your deck doesn't benefit too much from minefields in general. At least not in this deck, but whatever. Enough of that talk. Can get another CV. Those are reinforced to the left. I'm probably gonna overshoot the target with my Lars. Maybe I'm just gonna shoot directly into where he's gonna retreat. Maybe this was actually a 200 IQ play. Nah, I didn't even panic him. But I did get a nice crit. Otherwise I possibly would have died. Didn't really push that far up. Get another CV. Unlucky that my flicker press too missed.
GG. Right. Hope you enjoyed the video. I don't know when the next one will be.